Revelation 2086. From the 25th of September 1941. Purpose of Natural Disasters. It can be unhesitatingly stated that the earth will be afflicted by powerful natural disasters, indeed, these catastrophes should even be mentioned so that people will know that the respective events are not determined by coincidences. There is no such thing as a coincidence, everything is predetermined, and everything takes the path of higher development and the forthcoming natural disaster will release countless beings and provide them with opportunities for new forms. At the same time, however the disasters are intended to affect people such that they will look for a connection with God. People only consider the latter very rarely now, this is why God wants to bring himself closer to them again if only by means which cause fear and terror in people. But if events are proclaimed in advance a person will recognize the correlations and then entrust himself to the power which is able to help him. The forces of nature are the only means which can even shake up the most unbelieving person and lead him back to faith. Yet they never last long and likewise the will to believe only lasts for as long as a person is in danger of losing his life. However, the eternal deity will never intervene with anyone such that a person is forced to believe. Even in greatest physical adversity he will allow him his freedom. He certainly fights for the still imperfect souls but he does not force them. And therefore natural disasters will also have to occur within some conformity to law, they just happen more or less violently depending on the necessity for those endangered people who lack correct realization. And for that reason they shall be informed of the forthcoming events. Humankind shall become utterly helpless and with childlike trust call upon God for assistance. Prior to this it shall already be informed of the dreadful time it is approaching, and if it is only of weak faith all announcements will accept it with indifference since it will most likely assume that the announced event will not happen. And yet, people will remember it if their body and soul is in peril. And this intended, for as horrendous the effects of a natural disaster might be it always entails a shock to human thinking and this can also have a beneficial effect on people's faith, providing they had received the knowledge beforehand. For the whole of humanity is facing a turning point of life. And blessed is he who recognizes God's will in everything sent. Then he will truly not be able to behave differently than according to his will and only ever see the great adversity of his fellow human beings and look at the disaster as a means which can ease this hardship. And this disaster is imminent. It will come like a thief in the night. And is just as quickly over again, yet the result will be inconceivable. Amen.